Richard got himself tattooed at, at San Diego. Yeah. His first Comic Con, he got himself tattooed. Yeah, I feel this is going to. Do you want to show it to everybody? Now that they've officially declared their love affair, it's so branded. James Alexander, Marco McKenzie, Fraser decided. That's it. You even wore matching shirts. We the did, yeah, we know. Yeah. I came dressed as Richard Jeez, Rankin right. today. Yeah. So. <laughs> We've been working on this so hard, you kind of forget sometimes that mm -hmm. people aren't seeing stuff. So yeah. um, it's been really exciting to see their reaction. You had a point you wanted to make. It's uh, you know we do get some great fan mail. This is just this we get the cool we, we get the most <laughs> amazing like, random stuff. Yeah. Yeah. We wanted to reveal today that me and Rick. San Diego Comic Con. They're adopting a lovely little child together. So yeah, you know I read. Uh, I did a good bit of reading, obviously he's a historian, so I decided to maybe dive into that a wee bit. Uh, Richard, around. are you Scottish? No. <laughs> oh, you've given the game away, Sam. If I'm anyone actually needs American. subtitles. No. I, <laughs> no, I'm You're just the... always in character. I'm actually from the valleys. <laughs> That's so. right. Did you decide to wear the same thing? Yeah. Which one's which? Richard Rankin. Really? <laughs> what would be our double date? You and Richard could wear the same jackets. Yeah, Richard came dressed as me today. Yeah, I just thought I was so inspired by you yesterday and what you were wearing. I was thinking, I wonder if I can pull that off. Thanks. So and you, I think you've pulled it off remarkably well. Did you steal well. his clothes or was it Yeah, I recently outfit? snuck into his room, as oh. I've been known to do. Yeah. We are like, we've got the same boots and, and trousers. We are excited about Rollo. seeing Roger and Brianna together. And, uh, and how that relationship I'm develops. For Roger to potentially meet the family, meet the folks, meet the parents. I can't wait. I can, I can imagine if it was to happen, hypothetically, Roger meeting Jamie. I think it'd be just the best time. Sit I down and have a beer. I think they'll get on we really well. They'd get very close, wouldn't they? Wouldn't they? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. American popcorn. What's yeah, the deal? You guys like a lot of butter yeah. in your popcorn. What is that? Why don't you? You have sweet everything else. Yeah. You have this amazing ability to make everything sweet. Yeah, cinema popcorn, right. you yeah. only do drenched in butter. Yeah, and also your cinema snacks, or movie snacks as you like to call them, they, they yeah, need to be better. All... Yeah, where's the pick and mix? There we go. Wow, this I is think you're doing cool. an awesome job. Thanks, by man. Way. Thanks. You're, yeah. you're really good to interview. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, anyway, I'll let someone else take over now. Mostly, Enjoy it where mostly Brianna's <laughs> fault. It's usually Brianna's fault. <laughs> I mean, Roger's there, he's committed, he's totally devoted to Brianna. Any complications that arise, I'm sorry, you're looking at me like you want to kill me, Sam. <laughs> What are your intentions? <laughs> I just want to say right now, while you're there, that my intentions towards your, you know, pretend daughter are pure, <laughs> honest, and of love. What say you? <laughs> I doth approve. <laughs>